What's going on, guys? It's your girl, Janiqua A, and I'm back with another video for you guys. So, we are going to tap into our ancestors and see what do our ancestors want us to know as far as support goes. We've been dealing with a lot, a lot of emotions, a lot, a lot of changes, and just a lot, a lot of transformational energies around us. And we all need that support. And sometimes support don't come from the 3D, right? There's also a lot of loved ones that has passed away recently. So, I just want to tap in to kind of gain some support and uh see what can i grasp for anybody ancestors including mine right to just give us some confidence that we are on the right path i'm hoping all you guys are doing well i already prayed and meditated over the cards and we are gonna jump right into it also if you really really want me to tap into your energies go ahead and hit that like button so that way your energy can be manifested in this reading so we're gonna see what does your ancestors want you to know at this time collective i'm hoping all you guys are doing well if no one told you guys today i love you guys and i hope you know that all your dreams and aspirations do matter and we're gonna again get right into the reading you got the night be brave and honest you got star ancestors follow the voice of your soul All right, and you have direction guardian. All right, so I'm talking to someone that needs to make a choice on what type of path they are aligning with in their life. I'm talking to someone that is very, very smart, that is very, very intellectual, and that is very brave, but for some reason, they are not trusting themselves right now. You have been put on this earth to literally be a star being. Some of you guys are star seeds. I said that in my other reading. You guys really need to look that up and follow your voice. You guys been sent on this earth to really speak your truth. And that could be very, very uncomfortable because then what happens is when you are trusted by the divine to carry out this mission of truth and being there for others and speaking up for others because you are fully equipped and brave. To do so, you find yourself in a lot of situations that don't have nothing to do with you or because you wanted to stick up for somebody. And that is because you are trusted. You was put on this earth to do that. All right? You was put on this earth by your star family to literally do the right thing here. Do the right thing on earth. And that could be very, very scary, but you have no time to be scared right now because you have people to people to heal. You got yourself to heal. You got places to go. You got energies to transmute. You're very, very smart. You're very, very strong. You're very, very wise. And your ancestors is all around you at this time. You just need to follow your heart and really, really know that whatever it is that you are thinking right now, it may be drastic. You might be in a situation where you got to speak your truth and it's very uncomfortable because you know when you do, a lot of things are going to change. But that is what you literally are meant to do. You have been trusted to carry out a mission on truth here. The sword is all about truth and clarity. It's all about justice. Justice is not coming from a heart of favoritism. It's coming from a space of knowing that fairness is what needs to be implemented in this world. And you have been trusted to do so. You've fully, 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 fully backed up and supported by your ancestors, by your guides. Some of you guys need to stargaze. You might like the stars. You might like going out and just being in nature, especially at nighttime. That is because you are a star being and you feel it. And you have a calling on your soul right now. And it might need you to stand up for others. It might is calling you to stand up for yourself. Because when you make this decision and step into the limelight and do what's right, it's going to catapult you into the areas, the people, and the energies that you need to be around to be aligned all right with your mission there's a direction that you need to be taken and spirit when this call comes out is basically telling you are supported you just need to you know make that decision because we all have free will here 
We all have free will. At the bottom of the deck, guardian angel. What I told you, your guardian angels are here. You might see a lot of feathers when you go outside. If you don't, you will see them. And that is confirmation that you are on your right path. And when you see these feathers or when you see these things on the floor that may remind you of an ancestor or a loved one that passed, that is because you need to think about what you was thinking about at this time. So that way you know what these messages are. You might be at a place where you are uncomfortable right now because you got to speak your truth. Also, you guys been in hermit mode a lot. Um, you guys been in solitude. You guys have cut off your energy from a lot of people, places, and things. And that is because you might see things around you that is not really fear right now. There's a lot of things that around you that is really causing you to question and really... Um, you know, dig, dive deep into really, really what's going on, the, the the deeper issue here, all right? And that is because you have been silent, you have been observing, you have been really, really tapping into yourself to really evaluate things here, all right? The medicine guardian, some of you guys work in a, a medical field, some of you guys uh, you know, know how to mix up different herbs and things when you are sick. You guys are healers. People trust you with a lot of um, things when it comes to their health. Health, maybe you guys are therapeutic to others and yourself, so you are trusted with a lot of information because people trust your judgment. But you are uh, surrounded by medicine guardians. Be open to healing information. Not only that, not only are you guys some in some stature of healing and nurturing, but you are being nurtured. You are being healed. And Throughout this process, you're going to be receiving healing information that is going to be confirmation for you to carry out your mission here. Carry out your soul plan. Whatever it is that is feeling good to you at this time, your ancestors is supporting you. But it requires for you to speak the truth. It requires for you to clear your crown chakra and your throat chakra so that way you can clearly communicate what you need from others to find different solutions, right? What you want from others to make you happy. You have mountains. Stand your ground. What did I say? You are being called to speak the truth about something, whether it's you speaking the truth about yourself now and what and what you want and what you need, or you are standing up for others and fairness and justice and bringing justice to this planet because there's too much um, adversity. There's too much competition. There's too much lies and deceit that's going on. And literally, you have been trusted and carry it and carry on a mission. From your star ancestors to show your divine light on situations that is being hidden. Show and spread your divine light and shine your divine light on people, places, and things that need your energy because of low-level energies that are surrounding them. You are powerful. You have the power to, to switch places. You may be a person that always moved fast or you never was comfortable or you got bored with a certain situation i'm talking to someone that always has been on the move because they are so enthusiastic they have a lot of energy right you could have been moving from house to house or um ending and and beginning different relationships you i'm talking to someone that has been a shapeshifter here and now you are being called to, again, shapeshift and go towards a different path, a more truer path, a more path of communicative spirits, a path of less and, and, and no confusion here. Because you are divinely guided and supported to speak your truth moving forward. Clarity, structure, authority here. All right, you are a person of authority, you are a person of healing, and you have these attributes about yourself. You you know, you guys, what I'm saying right now is being in a being pushed in a position of power here, of power, because this is literally your mission here. 
from your ancestors, your star ancestors. You are a star being. You are being pushed in your rightful position of power. But it requires you to stand up and talk the truth and bring justice to situations that has none. And that can be a lot because justice is very, very little understood and missed by many, all right? You have the ability to go within. You guys know how to pull your energy back from people. You guys know how to trust your judgment and be a complete receiver from the divine, meaning your mind, all right? Not needing any validation from anything or anyone when it comes to making right and clear decisions, being clear about your position here on earth. Again, you're totally and fully and wholeheartedly supported, not only by the divines, but yourself. This is what you've been sent on this earth to do. So maybe that's why you find yourself being a healer or being that person to be there for others a lot of you guys work in a medical field a lot of you guys are working with children right now that is because you have some type of healing attributes that has been installed by your star family that is needed on this earth there's mountains that need to be moved here and you are fully equipped. Choose the direction that the mountains need to be moved. Move those mountains and stand your ground here. That is the, the, the message and support you need from your ancestors. Need I say more? At the bottom of the deck, you are the oracle. You are the oracle. Spirit is saying, wait for important information. There's important information that is going to be coming through as you meditate. It is very important as you meditate right now, okay? Meditate because that is where your downloads is coming from. That is where your healing is going to be really, really highlighted when you are, you know, tapped in. Even if you don't know how to do it, if it feels uncomfortable, you know, do it little by little, five minutes out the day. As you, you know, train your mind to tap into source, it'll get more comfortable. Literally, you have been here to speak your truth. And in order to do that, you got to be still. Don't you see these person's eyes are closed? Also, you guys are being balanced with your divine feminine and your divine masculine. So that way you can articulate yourself in a manner to where it's clear, where it's just. And people follow suit, all right? You are fully supported and you are a star seed here. You are the oracle. And you need to wait for important messages from the divine at this time because you are going to be told what to do as far as this situation goes. You are being, you're going to be guided. This is putting you in a position back to your rightful power, back to your throne here. The direction, guardians, is here. That is because you are fully equipped with wisdom, strength, and vitality here. You are the person to move these mountains that people could not. You have been sent here to cut through and 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 climb mountains that people couldn't. You, you are here to protect, support, and provide wisdom and fairness to this world and that is what's going to happen i love you guys